It's all chaos. Bunko made an appearance at the square. I heard that the rebel leader, Mr. Fig, has been dispelled. Don't listen to rumors. Last I heard, the enforcer herself was seen strolling about being friendly with Mr. Fig. It's better if we don't take sides in this war. Well, we'll have to do it sooner or later. I hope it never comes to that. been here before. An engineer called Daisy lives here. She was designing a rocket last time I spoke to her. Come on, there's an exit at the top of the staircase. Well, we can't get through here. I wonder if Banku caused this mess. We can probably climb Daisy's rocket and get out that way. is gone. I guess yeah, she finally launched, launched it. it. Flying to the ether. Is, is that, that even possible? possible? I guess we'll never know. And now we have to find another way to get out. What's that? Man! Lost pieces! Man! I can't move! Get off me, Street! Help me! Man! What's happening, Anne? They're helping us! I hope. Why are you thinking them? They almost devoured us. Don't you see? They're not lost pieces anymore. Well, how nice for them. Bye, take care. All right, can we move on now, please? At least we're safe now. Let's hope they find some peace. You have some powerful friends, Anne. I'm not sure. It must have been the caretaker. <laughs> Remember the last time we were here? Don't remind me. It wasn't that long ago. Feels like another life. Come on, follow me. Okay, follow. If you think you can convince me otherwise, you haven't met a belt before. You're a rebel and rebels are- We're freedom fighters. I want you off the streets. Who cares what you want? Yeah, you don't fool us. Sounds like you've been hit on the head a few too many times. All I want is to get back to the ether, feel a foot again. All you want is to destroy my dream. And that's all it is, a dream. Take that back, or... Or what? Or, or I'll distill you. You think this isn't a real depleter? He'll do it. You're a forgotten boot. A single boot. Your owner probably dumped you in a trash pile. Don't talk that way about my owner. No one cares about your owner. Yeah, keep going. We sure show them. Stupid, useless rebel. What a pointless loss. That was me. That boot was me. Not anymore. Come on. We need to move on. I can revive her. I just have to find a way down there. And I can bring her back. Fig. Are you ready to distill two forgotlings to revive one? You're right. We better move on then. <laughs> so, what is the plan? Getting inside the tower is not a problem. There's a secret entrance from my house. We still need to get past security at two stations, not to mention that lunatic gun forgotling. Chief Inspector Magnum, I can handle him. We'll pretend you're my prisoner and he'll let us in, no questions asked. Of course, the gun nut will just let us straight through. Will you trust me for once? I think you owe me that. All right, fill me in on the details, please. If I told you now, you'd refuse to go. Very encouraging. Over this way. Right behind you. Hey, it's the enforcer and rebel leader outside. Move it. I want to see too. 
it's feeding them? Not sure what they're doing. Hey, Billy, go back to your room now. She didn't distill any forgotlings, now I think about it. Stop being such a painthead. That distiller has driven you mad with power. Excuse me. That walkie-talkie got what he deserved. Quiet! What do you think about this walkie-talkie business? You could influence it, you know. I think I have an idea. I can revive that walkie-talkie if you want me to. Well... <laughs> Maybe that's not such a great idea now I think about it. She can't revive him. The Arca doesn't work that way. It does now. If that's true, maybe we shouldn't revive him. After all, he did distill one of our own. I'll revive him no matter what you say. Nobody should really be wielding this power over life. Chief Inspector Magna has gone mad. He's detaining just about everyone he meets. Ever since he heard the enforcers switch sides. Jump! I don't think I can make that jump! Come on, Anne. You can do it. Just aim for my hand. Are you okay, Anne? I'm fine. I'll find a way out. Don't worry, I have a plan, remember? About that. Isn't it about time you explain the details? The plan is, we jump down there and I distill you. What? We pretend that I went undercover to catch you. And to prove that I'm really on Banku's side, I distill you in front of everyone. I was distilled once and that's more than enough. <laughs> Let's just pretend that... Magnum needs to see me distill you. He 
is no clue that I can bring you back now. I'll revive you as soon as we're on board the train to the tower. You promise? I trusted you with my life once, didn't I? What do you want me to do? We jump down in front of everyone, and I say something like... Mr. Fig! I finally found you! Prepare to be distilled! And you say... Stay your hand! The darkness of your archer shall never reach my soul! Long live the Freedom Fighters! <laughs> yes, exactly! I knew you had an actor in you! That was perfect! Really? You think so? Absolutely! Then I distill you, bring you on the train, and revive you. All right, let's get to it. Someone's up there. Blum bum. <coughs> Man, I'm enforcer? How is this possible? Mr. Fig, at last I have you. Your rebel leader days are over. Prepare to be distilled. By me. Oh, had I but known that the Enforcer was on an undercover mission for Bonku and never was on my side after all. She sure fooled me. The end has come for you, Mr. Fig. I will now. So, this is how it ends. The terminus of my life has arrived, taking the form of an adolescent damsel. Observe. How the Lady of Anima prepares my inescapable doom. Fig, what are you doing? I have arrived at my day's cataclysmic conclusion. Indeed you have. And now you will... Oh, if only you knew what I have seen with these, my eyes. What I have felt with these, my hands. What I have smelled with these, my nostrils, never again shall I perceive any sensation of the... No, you shall not, because I'm distilling you now. What will be after the anima sectami? What will I become? To which destiny have my feet taken me? Had I but listened. Had I but seen the true way and bit to the wheel of Master Banku. No, I mustn't think like so. Not even in this, my final hour. Will I doubt my evil rebel ways? Yes, I am evil. I have seen the mirrors that are my eyes touch the darkness in my heart. Do I deserve this destiny? Truly. Alas, my fate is in her hands. Will she distill me soon? I must wonder. I knew it! I knew you'd never switch sides! This was your plan! I told you, didn't I tell you? What a plan. What a scheme. What a talent. Bravo, Enforcer. Thank you. It's good to be back. <laughs> Something not right. You're right. We have to celebrate. No need. Everything is fine the way it is. The rebel leader was finally caught by me, the Enforcer. Let me just get him on the train to the tower, and you can all go about your business. Yes, let's get on the train. Plum bum, seal, fig, and box. Yes, seal in that no good wooden trader and get him on the train. Just a moment.
Bowman. And Dorser have not worried at all. We can trust Plum Plum with this, Madam Endorser. Uh, Madam Enforcer. Allow me to escort you. I never imagined that my first time in the VIP lounge would be in your company, Madam Enforcer. Such an honor. It's over here. Madam? Where are you going? 